We already have 5,000 people who die every year in collisions with large commercial trucks and 100,000 injured. Those numbers are soon to go up because the Bush administration has decided to allow Mexico-based trucks full access to U.S. roads. This humongous death toll, and we can't afford for it to go any higher, but it will because we don't know that those trucks are safe. We don't know that the truckers are safe. The Bush administration has decided that if a truck was manufactured in 1996 or later, it'll be safe enough. Holy crap. Congress tried to put a stop to it. Actually did put a stop to it. Last year, Congress said, no funds shall be used to establish a pilot program for NAFTA trucks. President Bush signed it into law. So it's the law, but it doesn't really apply to them. That diesel fuel dripping out of there. There's already a limited border zone in which Mexico-based trucks can come across and unload their cargo for U.S. trucks to pick up and take into the rest of the U.S. Now, counties that run through that border zone have already seen a 40% increase in truck crashes. We're told that there's a small car that's pinned underneath. Tell Congress that it has to finish what it started. They're allowed to make safety a priority.